me and my brother were going to uh, Tennessee from Georgia, which we're in South Georgia, so it's going to be about a six-hour drive right up towards uh, North Carolina, Tennessee, because it's Elizabethton, Tennessee, which is like a little tip of Tennessee. So you have to go up to South Carolina, North Carolina. Anyway, so we're going there to pick up a skid steer engine for my skid steer. And uh, they got two of them, and uh, I made an offer on two of them, uh, about $600 a piece, which is cheaper than what he was uh, wanting to get for them. And so I might get both of them, I might get one, depends on condition. So first, like we, you know, last night I emailed him and he's like, I live behind the Walmart. And I got all scared. <laughs> like, oh, so I looked at the map and all there is behind the Walmart is grain silos, chicken houses, and an old um, warehouse. And I was like, uh-oh. So I like, this morning I woke up, because I asked him much of, questions via email but he didn't respond to him so I woke up this morning and wrote me and I was like dude I'm not gonna drive to some warehouse and get stabbed and then thrown in that river you have back there <laughs> I need a little more than that the deal's off and then he like messaged uh, texted me before he saw the email and he's like oh I, I own that warehouse it's my business so then it, you know became credible again and then I was like oh well ignore that email I sent you because I thought you were gonna stab me He's like, oh no, I, I assure you, I'm not going to stab you. And I guarantee the engines. I disassemble heavy equipment or something like that. Going to Shoney's. There's not a lot of these in Georgia. This, we're kind of, where are we? We're near Helen, I think. Oh yeah, we're still in Georgia, barely. Barely in Georgia. Um, well, you're going to eat. You're going to be hungry. Bacon. I love me some bacon. 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 Cop. I hear the cops up here are really bad. Mountains! Yeah, you're clear. Or should I wait to get past? I'm gonna get past this guy. Get past this guy. Mountains. There's a mob behind me now. Yeah, a lot of cars. I just wanna get ahead of this guy. That's all I wanna do. Go 90 and do it. Turn this guy. I'm old. That car got a ticket for being broken down. Right. There. Now you can all pass me. Oh, look at that beautiful mountain. They cut through that and make the road. Imagine how much work that is to make a road through a mountain. Oh my gosh. That had to be like months of work. Or a lot of dynamite. Probably a lot of dynamite. There's some kids hanging out on the back of a Bronco. There's like a child. There's like there's a baby seat. Let's send out the CPS. I had to film that. Put the hard shell back on the Bronco for God's sakes. Your toddler's gonna blow away. Baby here, got tomorrow. Exactly. There's a truck runaway ramp. That's cool. It has things that spike the tires and. Ah, that's pretty awesome in case your truck runs away to brakes fail. I've never seen one of those used before. I wonder how, I wonder if there's a video of that. Probably. I'll look it up. Beautiful scenery. I don't know if that land's mowed or if they just have goats on that because that, that grass looks low. <laughs> Watch that side, kind of push it. Yeah, you're clear. Start going down or a little more in? A little more in. <laughs> Did it start leaking right away? Uh, Did it start leaking right away? I don't know. <laughs> I think 
that. Yeah. Not inch. Well, yeah, I'll try it. Yeah, right. yeah. Yeah, that's right. We're good. We got about a half inch. Good. Keep going. Keep going. Yeah, you're about to clear that light, then it domes out and gets bigger. What about the top of the Yeah, you'll close on that right there. Yeah. Yeah. How are you going to get it out, though? <laughs> Push. Yeah, if you guys push again, we'll back up. Oh, yeah, well. Go ahead, yeah, man. <laughs> Ain't too bad. Ain't too bad. Now your fuel economy just went down by about five miles per gallon. Yeah. Plus, he wants, we're going to hit some goodwill outlets. <laughs> man, yeah. This guy bought that tire warehouse just to scrap it cheaper than the warehouse and the land was and so he has a little shop back there I bought uh, two Wisconsin's uh, one runs really well one's a little bit harder to start uh, I paid um, 1100 for the engine so about 550 a piece I, I could turn around and sell the one that's not running as good probably for about 800 and I'm probably gonna keep it I'm, d I'm debating that because I can make a package deal with the other engine that uh, my engine I'm pulling and, uh, but that one that's right there runs really well. The one that's mounted on a skid. And it's a skid that he said they used to transport nuclear waste. He's in the scrap business. Real nice guy. But anyway. Whoops. Whoops. It is. We'll uh, get our whereabouts here in a second. Got a very loaded down van. Very loaded down. Uh, I'm guessing a thousand pounds. Oh, no, no. 